Now, breaking news from KXAN News. Polygamous sect leader Warren Jeffs just found guilty of sexually assaulting two underage girls in West Texas. Our Jared Wise live out to the courthouse in San Angelo with more from there. Jared? It was another unusual day here in the courthouse you see right behind me. As you said, Jeffs is guilty on sexual assault of both of a child and sexual aggravated sexual assault. The court has now begun the sentencing phase. Now, it took the jury nearly four hours to decide on that verdict. During the deliberation, they asked to see the transcript from testimony of Rebecca Musser, who used to be a member of the church and also wanted to hear the audio recording of Jeffs, Jeffs possibly engaging in a sexual act with a 12 year old girl while two women were watching. Now, that same recording was played as evidence for jurors yesterday before the prosecution rested their case. Jeffs, who's representing himself, rested his case this morning, only bringing one witness to the stand. Before Now, before firing his lawyers, Jeff's legal team had planned to bring several witnesses to testify. Not one of them did. In closing arguments, they, both sides were allowed 30 minutes to speak to jurors. When it was Jeff's chance to speak, he stood up and stared at the ground and slowly gazed at jurors and a judge for more than 20 minutes, not saying a word. Then right before the time was up, mumbled what sounded like the words, I am at peace. Now, once again, court is back in session behind me. Sentencing phase has now begun. Jeff's is facing a maximum of life in prison, and I'll be following the remainder of the trial and have the latest for you as soon as it becomes available. Live in San Angelo, Jared Wise, KXAN News. And that report provided through wireless technology. Thank you very much, Jared. Well